Hey guys, what's up? Um, my name is Cherza, if you don't know me. Um, if you're new to this channel, don't forget to subscribe down below. I just want to show you guys how a lot of the world we live in today is filled with fear. And you will see it everywhere you go. Turn on the TV. Go on YouTube. Think about your government, wherever you live in the world. Think about, think about how people treat you at school. Think about how your teachers talk to you. Think about your boss. How do they treat you? Think about all of this stuff. Just think about it. And think real hard because I know, I know Deep down in your subconscious mind, it knows that people feed off of fear. It's sad, but that's what the darkness wants. I actually wrote something on my Instagram, which I will let you know in two seconds, but I just want to comment one thing. When people have fear in themselves because of whatever things, whatever insecurities or whatever things they have to overcome, they try their absolute hardest to instill fear in whatever way possible in other people, whoever it may be in their life, they will attempt so hard with all their might and all their effort to instill that fear into anyone around them. It could be their own kids. It could be anyone, literally anyone. And I wanna let you guys know that there is one thing that is stronger than fear and it is Jesus Christ and his love his love for you he has so much love for you I cannot even express it with words he loves you so much he knows every little detail about you he knows how good you are deep down and he wants you to open up to him and he wants you to love him but he can't force you to I just want to let you know something that I said on my Instagram today, on my Instagram story, and I'm just going to read it out loud right now. One second, my battery's dying. Okay, I'm just going to read you guys what I wrote on my Instagram this morning. You might not even understand what I do and constantly talk about, or maybe you think I'm crazy. But those of you who know who you are who do that and refuse to understand the love of Jesus Christ now are refusing his offer of eternity and eternal love. Someone commented, Hail Satan, on my recent YouTube video about my love for Jesus Christ. And to be quite honest with you, the choice is yours. If you want to hail Satan, no one's stopping you. Have fun. But I'll be over here enjoying the good life with Jesus Christ. And that is the truth. That is the truth. And I honestly could not tell you how amazing Jesus Christ is and how happy he makes me. He, he allows me to see things I have never seen before. Um, even this morning I went for a walk at like 5 a.m. I asked, I asked, like it was a long story, but I was talking to God for a long time and then I said, God, please show me a shooting star. And a shooting star appeared and it was so beautiful and just so many miracles and wonders that God and Jesus, God slash Jesus Christ have and give and want to give you. You just have to open yourself up if you want. He can't force you. He won't force you. It's up to you. The choice is yours. So anyways, I'm just kind of expressing to you guys my, the beginning of my journey with Jesus and everything. I'm very spiritual. And that will never go away. That is who I am. And that is what I believe. And no one can make me say otherwise. Nobody. No one. I want to show you guys what a glimpse of darkness and fear can look like. And maybe this will give you guys a little bit of a push towards love and the light that Jesus has waiting for you. I'm a, I'm a ghost, you go, you go, call. Boss 
Bouncing with the scarecrow in the field, no Lucifer report as a guard Fish on the blood dripping down my 